All right, we just finished up our final uh, code quality root pass in the 4G overhead position using stick welding or shielded metal arc welding. This is a little mock up of our uh, fit up. It's upside down, eighth of an inch root opening, eighth of an inch face, kind of big. Um, just because we're using that eighth inch 6010, that's kind of old, so I don't want it to freeze. So we're just going to open it right up. And then uh, we're on direct current electrode positive, 91 amps. We'll do three plates. We'll kind of line them up from worst to best. Hopefully one of them, will, at least one of them will be a code quality weld. So we'll go out in the lab and we'll burn this thing in. That is our machine set up here. It's Miller. We're going to be on stick, instead of TIG, panel, instead of remote, on, instead of remote, off, instead of any of these uh, continuous. That's for uh, TIG, 91 amps. And then down here, direct current electrode positive. Let's burn it in. All right, we uh, just did three overheads here. We're having a hell of a time getting the shot. So what we did on the fourth one, try and get it. We put a plate over here and a plate over here to try and get rid of some of the light coming through from the, the well going through the other side. And we're, we're having a hell of a time. So we're going to edit what we can out of this. And hopefully you can uh, see what you can see. It's just really hard to do this in overhead position. So. This was the worst one we had, and not that it's that bad, but our start and our stop is just atrocious. See, you're going along good, and then bow. Clearly not a code quality weld. That, that was our worst fit up. There was a big warp in the middle where the gap was actually over an eighth of an inch. So I'm going to say that was just bad fit up but that's a huge hole, not even close to being code quality. The rest of it, however, is pretty good. So we'll go to our second one here. All right, this is our second weld here. It's pretty close to code quality. There's a little bit of an error. Scroll down here, right there, you can see a little bit of an error. It's a little bit of a it almost looks like undercut on the on the back side here not quite fused and then right there it gets a little thin but it's still pretty close right there so I, I'm gonna say this one isn't code quality it's pretty close though but we'll go to our uh, third one here here's our third weld came out pretty good 
fused all the way through here. That's the only sketchy spot right there, but it actually is level with the plate. I don't know if you can see on the camera shot. It's a start and stop, and it's fused there. Keep going here to the end. It's going to be a cold quality weld, however. There it is, the whole thing again. Yeah, I don't know, Thanksgiving's next week. I don't know what the next video we're going to do is, but uh, for now, thanks for watching and subscribing to TV Weld, and we'll get back at it after uh, Thanksgiving.